Hey guys, what's up? Um, so I received my uh, snack crate. I'm so excited. Yeah, so to catch people up that don't know, um, I subscribe to a, a website called Snack Crate, and what Snack Crate does is they send you a box of snacks um, from around the world, and each month is a different country. Since I subscribed for the first time, they let me choose what country I wanted to get snacks from. So I, ch uh, it was either the United States, which I live in the United States, it wouldn't be that exciting. It still probably would be, but um, the United States, Korea, or the United Kingdom. And I chose the United Kingdom because I felt like that was pretty safe for the first one. So we're gonna unbox this and see what's good in here. If I can figure out how you open it. Made with recycled materials. Please recycle. <laughs> I can't even get the box open. Give me one second. Um, this might help. So, this is what it looks like. It says, welcome this to this month's snacking adventure. Get social with us, share your snack experience. Hashtag snack create, which I probably will be putting out in my video. Um, it says, <clears throat> this month's crate is from the UK. I don't know what this is. Just like a sticker. I'm so excited. I like to try new things. Oh boy. Okay. <clears throat> the United Kingdom, also called the UK, consists of a group of islands off the north northwest coast of Europe. They made up of four nations: England, Wales, Scotland, and Northern Ireland. So some fun facts about the United Kingdom. Every day, people drink 165 million cups of tea. Wow. In the UK. Um, people have been living in the UK for 30,000 years. Champagne was invented here in 1662. Big Ben is not the clock. It's the bell. I didn't know that. Soccer, rugby, and polo were invented here. James Bond's codename 007 was the name of the author Ian Fleming's bus route to London. And the last one is the Queen is the legal owner of one sixth of the Earth's land area. Uh, so the first, uh, I'm already not liking this. <laughs> um. First snack is Walkers or or sisters or or. <laughs> I can't even say the word. This this word right here, War Worcester, Worcester, Worcester. I don't know. These may look familiar. That's because Walkers is owned by Lay's. They don't smell that bad. <laughs> Why do people eat this stuff? Alright. You know. It kind of reminds me of crab chips. Next. Oh, the frazzles delicious bacon flavored corn chips I can probably deal with that oh my god they even look like little bacons <laughs> mm, 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 mm. yeah it tastes like bacon Yeah. 
whatever. <laughs> Only 39. Whatever that means. Must be healthy. Mm. They got really, really strong taste of bacon. <laughs> now, <laughs> I don't know about these. Oh, these are Skips Prawn Cocktail Flavored, whatever these are, Chippies, I don't know. I'm stressed out. Ha <laughs> ha, ugh. They stink. Look, just don't like these. What do I want to try next? This is the good stuff. I'm excited. Mm. What are these? Oh, they like melted. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, these are Maltesers. Uh, created in 1937. These fantastic malted milk ball excuse me, malted milk balls were once marketed as a diet chocolate. Can't go wrong with chocolate. Well, milk and milk balls from milk chocolate. But it's like chocolate from UK, so it's like rich. But actually, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, what's next? God, they're all chocolate. Okay. What are you? Alright, this is a flake. This is Cadbury's chocolate layered so that it flakens when eaten. Commonly served in vanilla ice cream and called a Flake 99, which I'm about to get some vanilla ice cream, honestly. Mm. It's crumbly. Oh, oh wait. It's like pure chocolate. On Cadbury, they uh, they make stuff over here in America. Ugh. Okay, what's next? A sherbet fountain. A fun dip style candy with fizzy powder and licorice dipping stick. Twist to open. Well, there's that. Oh god. This is gonna be sour. I can feel it. You know, I would buy this. I should probably eat the licorice, you know. It's like stuck on my teeth. <laughs> Come on, get a good brush in when I'm done. Oh, I finally get to eat one of these. I'm so excited. This is a Cadbury Double Decker. This two-layer chocolate bar is crispy cereal bits on the bottom and creamy nugget on the top. And I never ate a nugget before, and I really hope there's like... I should probably read. I'm allergic to peanuts and anything nutty. I feel like a nugget, nougat, is...
Who knows? <laughs> YOLO. Maybe a nougat's... I don't know. Let me break some off because other people are going to try this too. Mmm. It's like a... It's like a three musketeer, basically. Oh, it got crunchy on the bottom. Uh. Tunnox Caramel Wafers. Made in Scotland. These chocolate covered caramel biscuits are amazing. I can't figure out how to open it. I mean, again, the chocolate is rich, but it tastes really good. More chocolate. What's it called a crunchy? A golden honeycomb center surrounded by delicious Cadbury milk chocolate. Launched way back in 1929. Crunchies are a Cadbury classic. I don't know. Alright. It's chocolate, so what can you do? God, it's a lot. I don't want a big piece. <laughs> oh, it's a honeycomb. Look at it. Oh. I don't know. It looks scary. Wow. I don't know how I'm gonna like this, but um <clears throat> Maynard's Maynard's wine gums. Strangely strangely these taste nothing like wine and they aren't gum either. Despite the branding weirdness, this candy is awesome, apparently. We'll see. Oh, look at it. Of course I get it. A yellow one first. I don't like yellow or anything. Ow, I got cavities. I think she ends this place. Alright, I got two more things. I feel like they're both gonna hurt my teeth. This is called a curly whirly. It says, imagine a chewy caramel ladder. Now drape it in delicious milk chocolate. Around since 1970, curly whirly is still a firm favorite. I didn't. Alright, hold on. It's pretty chewy. I mean, uh huh. Ooh. Last but not least is a lamb. And yeah, it's last. <clears throat> Described as raspberry flavored chew bar, lamb bars are loaded with fizzy crystals. That's probably why it's called lamb. Oh, I don't like raspberry. <laughs> <laughs>